How do you, when you've had your life savings and everything that you've planned in your whole life uh, is sort of like wiped from under you, what prayer do you say? Do, first you cry, well, I mean, what, what? I cried, I had, I had very close friends. The first one I called said to me, nothing of value has been lost. And I said to her, this is not the time to be spiritual. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Yes, uh, we're only spiritual. <laughs> we're only spiritual. When we're happy right. and things are going and well. When we, have a, when we know we have a lot. So. <laughs> this is not the time to be spiritual. Get it. And... Uh, yes. But then I realized. <laughs> That's funny. I, I had to, but you know what, Oprah? What? That was one of the best things that ever happened to me in my life. How so? And you know why? How because so? when you, lo I lost every, we lost everything. We lost, we lost all of our money with Madoff, all of it. And the 30 years of life savings, gone. All of it. Got a phone call. Janina, you sitting down. I thought my friend was going to tell me she had just had a bad hair day. Mm -hmm. And instead she said, Madoff is in handcuffs. And I realized we've now lost everything. And had you suspected anything before? Nothing. Because the friend who got us involved with it mm -hmm. had been invested for 30 years. And they and, lost everything too. And he got all of his other friends into it out of the generosity of his heart because he really thought yes. it was it. Come on, this guy's so great. But when you lose everything, because I had to focus on what I had, not what I didn't have, because there was no way of getting through the night with that kind of terror of having lost everything. Talk about shame and blame. Yes, Blaming because you blame yourself oh. for not seeing, for not knowing. How could anybody not know? And, so, and then I realized if I was gonna live if I was going to sleep, if I was going to exist, I had to bring my mind back from the, from the terror and start focusing on what was good. And it, I had to be fierce about it. There was no choice about it because otherwise I would careen off into such grief and terror and shame and it was not a way to live. I mean, it took me a couple of days to come to this. Good friends who basically said to me, focus on what you have enough of not what you've just lost. And so I'd pick up a cup, I have a cup, I have water, I have arms, I have legs, I have breath, I have a husband I love, I still have a roof over my head. And, and you know what? The most amazing thing happened. Within three to four days, maybe a week, I was happier than I had been in years. When you had lost everything. Yes, because when you start seeing what you have, not what you don't have, what's good, not what, what's wrong. Okay, but so tell me, what did you still have? Because it's one thing if you say, I lost everything, but my house was paid for, and I had, so you know you're going to have your home, right? I didn't, my house was not paid for. Okay. I had the house, but which was mortgaged up to the hilt, mm. plus a home equity line of credit that we owed on. Mm. Big mortgage, car, sweaters, and that was it on the physical level. So when you get the phone call, do you first think, how are we going to live? Or do you first think, we're doomed? Do you first think? Oh, yes. Doomed. Doomed. Completely doomed. 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 I call my husband, who's in Antarctica at the time, and I said, hi, honey, nobody died, but we did lose all of our money. We start crying, both of us. He says, sweetheart, we're gonna be okay. But I had confidence in myself after a week that, that my mind could start going to the brink of terror and I could bring it back. So no matter what horrible thing happened ever for the rest of my life, I saw that if I was conscious about noticing what I did have, not noticing what I didn't have, noticing what was good, that changed my mood every day. Hi, YouTubers. 
I'm excited to give you an update about our own YouTube channel. Now you can find new videos every day. They're the kind of videos that will make you look at life differently. They may even make you laugh a little bit. Subscribe to the own channel today, and we'll see you on YouTube.